Lou, you work with AI. Do uh, you don't think that we're having another AI winter or that winter is coming? Do you? No, no, no. It's, I think it's just picking up. It's the complete opposite in my eyes. I mean, if we if we talk, go back to Apple for a second. I mean, they're just used to shipping refined experiences, right? I mean, but when you see things like Manus or ChatGPT and they're doing things on people's data like Apple normally does in a very clear and concise way, like I feel like Apple's feeling like, oh, wow, we, we have to really refine this to make it more useful for people. So I, I don't think there's a winter company. I definitely think it's it's booming. It's going to continue to boom. And do you think that we are getting that it's getting smarter and smarter? Absolutely. I've seen a number of people say <laughs> say that uh, ChatGPT 4.5 was a nothing burger. I think it's <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, they, they I think they did themselves wrong there, right? By putting out a model that was only refined in a personality sense, and then charging that much more per token, like people fell off their chairs when they saw that it was a sticker shock. It wasn't smarter. It just was more conversational, right? Do people? I mean, I think that's also a problem. I would bet when you get to market or or at least to your testing with both uh, an improved uh, Alexa and Siri is that it's going to be chatty. Yeah. And I, I don't think we want a little chatty little device in our house, do we? Every, every, Echo devices already do that. They'll like give you a They're notification too, yeah. or something. And I, I just want to say, please shut up. I didn't yes. ask for this. Don't give me a recommendation. You don't for a say that. Ask for. Yeah. 